And what better way to celebrate the Oscars than with a party? Sebastian Sentner is with Eatertainment, and he's here to show us how to bring glitz and glamour of the Oscars into our home. This is a pretty nice setup. Uh, yeah, you know what? We're all ready for Oscars. And when you do plan a party, first thing you want to know about is what are you going to do for food and drink? Food and drink, absolutely. So we're going to start out with, we're going to do some theme stuff. So it's all about the King's Speech. Yeah. This is the first one we did. And what we did is we did a bangers and mash martini. <laughs> very, very simple to do. So basically it's two different colors of mash. Yeah. And then what we're going to do is we're going to garnish it with some little okay. slices of sausage. Simple, simple. A little bit of chive. Just and there we are. Water. That's Good to perfect. Go. And it's great because it's a stand-up item. So you can actually walk around with it, Hold eat it, it while you're sort of enjoying the Oscars. Nice. Excellent. And then to go with that, we wanted to do an interesting cocktail. So we did the crowned cocktail, or the royal, as we okay. call it. Okay. And what it is, basically, it's got Grey Goose vodka in it. I'm going to put a splash in there. Uh -huh. I've added some other ingredients, including soda water, martini, a little bit of bitters. Here, this is yuzu juice. So it's a little bit juice? yuzu juice is a fruit juice. You can get it at some uh, oh, high-end right, grocery right, right. stores. Okay. But you can also, if you can't find yuzu juice, you can also use a mixture of pineapple lime. So a bit there. And then, this is kind of fun, I'm going to add just a touch of edible gold sprinkles. Where do you get those? Well, you get those at specialty stores, or you can buy it online, actually. And just, oh, that know. looks great. And that's about as royal <laughs> as it gets. I love that. Okay, so? Food. So that's, that's all King's... Uh, King's speech. That's so that's okay, yeah, kind of like fun and everything else. But you can also do a lot more. So what we've done here is these are more general movie I love themed. This. And these are cupcakes that are supposed to look like popcorn. <laughs> they do. They're kind of fun. It's a little bit different. And what we've and also festive. Festive and you know what perfect for the season mm -hmm. and people can munch on them, great for kids or adults. And We've also done a couple of things down there. Now, that is, again, more of a Texas theme, so yeah. true grit, country yeah. strong. Those are both um, salami chips, very easy to make. You just do them in the barbecue or pan fry them quickly. Honestly easy? Super, Honestly? super easy, and you okay. can make them thick or thin. <laughs> and then we also did another cocktail there, which is more of a Western-inspired cocktail. Okay, so when you talk about, I mean, you've done a nice setup here, but your decor, your ambiance, the music. The music. The music sets the mode right away, sets the tone. You want people to come in. As soon as your guests arrive, there's some great music playing yeah. and some fun. So what we did here is I actually did a playlist that's all about the Oscars. So it's got some Oscar soundtracks, but also some music that's inspired. So Tiny Dancer, for example, for... There we go. There we go. Press it. And there you go. It plays. And the system's called Sonos. So what I can do is I can control it from wherever I am and just plug in my iPod. I'm good to go. <laughs> really easy, really fun. And then you're not running around all night trying to put exactly. music on. Exactly. And then you've also got some fun in store. We do. So, you know, we want to kind of have a paparazzi feel to yeah. things, right? So as your guests arrive, we're going to pop this out. We're going to go like this and... There we go. Bang. Quick There's picture. There's a picture. Okay, and what's going to come out in a couple of minutes yep. is a tiny little picture like this. So everybody gets their own paparazzi shot. They get at paparazzi your party. shots, exactly. So as people are sort of coming in, and you can also do it with a digital camera. So you can have two things going on. Maybe update your Facebook page or do a Twitter feed. You download it right on your iPad right. or something right away. You know, social network. You're sort of trying to incorporate that theme as well. And trivia. Trivia, of course. Now, no Oscar party would be complete without some yeah. trivia. So what we did there is we decided to take a bit of a departure. Instead of doing your traditional trivia, yeah. is we thought that we would come up with Look some more interesting cards. little yeah. questions. So they're questions that are actually about your guests. So, for example, who's most likely to win in a gun drop? <laughs> or who's the drama king of the group? Something that's kind of fun, interesting like that. Most likely to relive a childhood sports fantasy. Exactly. Love it. Very fun. And then what you can do is you can have a sort of a prizing. So what we did is we did two prizes. Yep. We did a grand prize. And what I did is I loaded up this thing. This is called an iWatches. Yeah. And basically, it's an iPod Nano that has all the soundtracks loaded onto it. Look at that. And we basically give it away to the grand prize winner. You have your whole panel of guests become your Oscar critics. And if you don't win that, you get some food to take home. You do, absolutely. We're going to do some chocolate bark, and it's inspired by 127 hours. Okay, that's great. Sebastian, thanks so much. My pleasure. Have a great Sunday Oscar night. Thank you, you too. You can find all the recipes on our website, canam.cdv.ca. Up next, looking for linens. Carl Loans breaks down how to get the best deal at the Winter White Sale.